Hello everyone, Sigler here, Bork, Chef, you can call me whatever you'd like. Today I wanted to like to discuss like why I think enchanting is so important to have. Like if you don't have it on your main, me for example on my paladin I have mining and skinning for example and my other, not like my level 29 druid I have, what is it, uh, alchemy and engineering. But I don't have enchanting, and I really want to like emphasize. I, I think that's what you call it, like emphasize on like why it's. I think it's so important to have, and why it's so nice to have, like on an alt. So I'm here on my alt, which is Bork Chanter. is a level five warrior. You need to be level five to do this. But on level five, you can actually learn uh, enchanting. Uh, let me just lower the volume a bit for me. There we go. Um, on level 5 you can learn enchanting. And the great wi thing with enchanting is that uh, a lot of the times... Le le let's go to auction house and I can s uh, like explain to you why, for example. Um, let's see here. Let's search for this. Let's take this, this item, for example. Let me just search for that one. Oh, come on. Really? You have to do that now. <laughs> Slash reload. Okay, let's reload. <laughs> the add-on, the trade skill master crashed for some reason. Uh, let's do like this. Come on, potato PC. You can do better. Um, mm -mm -mm. There we go. Let's try again and see if this works better. Let's take this item right now, for example. And let's do like that. There you go. Here, for example, let's say that we get this drop. And it's a vendor sale for four silver each. Like, if you get it, like, you could vendor trash it. And you will get four silver and 97 copper. But if you have, like, a trade skill master... Uh, uploaded, like, uh, installed and everything. And you have the trade skill master... Uh, add-on in the background on your PC, you will get like the actual prices on the on um, on everything from the auction house while you're leveling. And if you have this setting on the disenchant uh, value, you can see that if I would buy this right now, um, it disenchants for thirty-nine silver, for example. So let's say I get this. Instead of vendor trashing it, I could send it to my alt if I don't have enchanting on my main that I'm actually playing on, remember. But like, instead of doing that, I could buy them, I could uh, disenchant them, and disenchant them. I can send them to my disenchanter and disenchant them, and sell the actual enchant. Because the, the positive thing and the nice thing with enchant uh, materials is that it doesn't cost anything to put on the auction house. So this one, for example, let's go over here. I've, I've set it up so you can see it's, it's tracking only my warrior. I did level it up and I didn't do anything until here. I level it up and yeah, I started sending a few stuff while I was leveling. And I logged into it. I disenchanted stuff, and boom, six gold. I mean, it's not much, but it's like it, this character will, will be like 100% profit, pretty much. Like, it, it will go uh, go up unless I buy something, for example. And, like, I could buy that one. Let's say this one. For example, I could buy this one. And have a chance of it of actually being the 39 silver. Because you can be a little bit unlucky and get like a a blue enchant material. And in this case, like blue is nice. But in this case, the blue one is going to be like 2 silver or something. So you can be a little bit unlucky. But it's a like very low chance of you getting a blue material. But for some items, it could be nice. But this one, I'm for, I'm certain that the level 19 blight gloves will be a bad one if it if uh, the enchant disenchant well the enchant material that is gonna become becomes a blue one. I know that that is gonna be a bad one. But like if I'm lucky, 
I could buy this one for 30 silver right now, for example. Like, I know it's not much, but then I disenchant it and get the 39 silver, and I could sell that. But with this character, I'm not going to buy stuff from the auction house to hope that it's going to be a better thing than its actual cost. But I'm going to show you one, uh, one thing that is really nice with this. So let's take a armor piece, for example. I am I know that I'm going to spend a, a little bit of gold right now. But let's take this one, for example. And let's pick a, a green one. A green item. Wait. Oh, okay. Uh, let's take a cloth piece, for example. And let's surf for the, the cheapest one. Remember, these ones are level 60. So... That was not that cheap. And let's pick another one. I'm not cer certain if I could actually disenchant that thing. So let's see there. And the uncommon and search. I really need to find one. Because I'm like, I don't want to spend all my gold that I actually have on this one. Yes, yet. Although it's just six gold. So it doesn't really matter. Because it's not that much. Um, weapons are going to be way more expensive. That is a certain. Let's take like this then, and no, not there, and this one, search. Because, uh, well, let's take this one, for example, this, this 53 male waist. Let's buy this one. I'm just going to show you what I mean that it's nice to have on an alt. Because I know that I've mentioned this in the past in a, like, I think it was like in phase one. But I really want to have emphasize why it's so nice to have, like, just an alt. Because even though, even though this is a level 53, and I'm 50, I'm level 5, and my enchanting at the moment is like, what is it? It's 11. Even though I'm only level, uh, like, 11 in profession, I can still disenchant it. Because in classic, you can actually do that. So now, for example, I got two of the illusion dust. I know that this is not a profit one right now, but I just wanted to show that you can and you can disenchant stuff. So if you have a level only, let's say that you only have one level 60 and you're playing on it and you're farming or stuff like that and you don't have enchanting on it. The good thing with having it like this is that if you're doing level 60 content, you will get uh, the like... Almost level 60, like let's say you're getting like a level 55 to 60 green piece, a green piece item. You could send it to your alt and disenchant it. You don't have to sell it, but you can actually save the material because if you're playing on level 60, you're getting basically like free materials instead of buying it from the auction house, like constantly. It might not be like extremely much, but it's a, it's a way that you most likely can save some gold. And sure, some items is not worth enchanting. Some items are actually worth putting on the auction house. Let's say that it's like a fiery, um, f uh, like fire damage one or shadow damage or anything like that. Or like a stamina or something that we know that is uh, relevant right now. It, then it's like really nice to actually just have on an alt just so you can get this for example let's say i don't wanna i'm not gonna sell this one my let's say my my fifth my my paladin is level 60 it's not 60 yet but let's say i'm like i like to aoe farm on it while i'm not raiding for example and i could farm gold um and also farm like greens just for enchanting materials for my my actual character. So yeah, it's just a little small tip. It's not huge. It's not like a game changer or anything. But I know for a fact that a lot of people are kind of like surprised that this actually works. So yeah, it's just nice to have. And also in, in Season of Discovery, just after a while you will get a little bit higher in your enchanting and if you're getting to like the so you can make the first wand sometimes that is actually worth crafting 
just because it's part of the Wailed Supplies and pretty much everyone uh, like that is a Warlock, Priest or Mage wa want a wand. Because it's very nice to have while you're leveling in Classic WoW. But yeah, I just wanted to small uh, share this small tip and it's, like I said, it's not a game changer. And Put a comment down in this in the below the video and tell me like if you knew about this uh, or if you felt like this is helping you and if it did if you feel like it's helping you please click on the like button and I I would really appreciate that but if you already knew about this that's awesome that you already knew that but yeah click on this video and uh, you will see a recommended video from me from the past and uh, yeah I uh, hope to see you in the next one in this video. But yeah, <laughs> um, until next time. Bork, bork!